You want me to introduce you? Do you guys know who she is? You know, yeah. I have not had the chance to watch the film yet, what? but I know! I really want- I, I know! I'm having a great time. You Are you guys having a great time? You're doing Are it! Are you guys enjoying this? Are you? Right behind us. All I had to do was look behind me and she's just shining with that platinum hair and that coat. Oh! Oh! oh. Single! Oh. Are you single? Single! Oh, single. <laughs> Are you saying all swimming? What is this? Oh, what is this? Ding. What is this? Uh, this is how she leaves us off. Traffic is in theaters. <laughs> April 20th, tomorrow. She did all of her own stunts for this movie, which is incredible. Wow, she, she did not have a stunt double. Yeah, she did not have a stunt double. So, mm -hmm. would you do your own stunts? Oh, absolutely. Oh, oh absolutely. Oh, I would. Do you not know me? Oh, I'm you crazy. Okay, you I'm did. a crazy, adventurous yeah, human being. Yeah, from Ryan Coogler's Black Panther to Wrinkle in Time, uh, Girls Trip. What else? Sorry, uh, I, I did. We had a technical thing. That's okay. Do you want to get out? Hey. Uh, you know, th this is just an incredible time. It's Black Movie Magic, baby. And we gotta celebrate. Uh, Wait a minute. Saudi Arabia just lifted their cinema ban. Of 25 years. Listen for Black Panther. Look at you now, now if, your eyes. Hey, hey, now. Okay. If, I'm oh, National, wait, wait, wait. National okay, High Five Day. I was going to say National High Five Day. give you a high five on National High Five Day. If that's not breaking records, that is. I don't know what is. If that's not breaking barriers, mm. I don't know what is. Yes, you, I like that you knew that fact Thank about Saudi you. Arabia. I really, I do my you homework. Know. I just want to say one thing really say quickly. It. Say I it know. Now. I love the two of you together. I mean, it, it really is a beautiful thing. Black filmmaker, female producer, I mean, female working producer. together. Talk and about making it. magic. Hello, my name is Tyler Avon, and I'm here with Hip Hop Real Estate at the NFL Experience. And well, that's exactly what it is. It's an experience for the fans. There's just so many people here, tons of great energy, so much to do, so many cool, so many cool events. So let's go check it out. You saw it here first. This is what everyone is fighting for: the Vince Lombardi Trophy. Lady Gaga, Beyonce, Coldplay, Bruno Mars. Pick one. Who, who are you the most excited to see? It's your least favorite part. Playing with Thomas J. Cool. Yes, this was uh, like yeah. Blue. I'm very, very sneaky, ma'am. All right, well, can I just say I love your energy? It like it like brings me joy. It brings me joy. I bet you you bring a lot more joy to people. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Tyler Abron here with HHRE Group in Toronto for the Celebrity All-Star Game. I'm here with Terrence J right now. So how do you think you did tonight? NBA for ESPN. So how do you think tonight's game went? Tonight was a- You are an NBA fan? You should have been here. You should have been here and I'm glad I was here. Hello, this is Tyler Abron here with Hip Hop Real Estate and today on 101015, I am standing here in Washington, D.C. for the 20th anniversary of the Million Man March. It's been 20 years since this historical event has taken place in 1995 and today's gathering is about justice or else. We spoke to a lot of people and got a lot of great input and we hope to see media change and justice for all. This is Tyler Abron with Hip Hop Real Estate. Thank you. You know what, that's a beautiful thing for it to be your birthday and for you to be celebrating today with this concert going on, Westchester County Center's first rap concert, so that's pretty huge. Did you ever think that yourself and all of the artists that you have would be, so it would become so legendary and just so great? You were never complacent with just, you know, being a millionaire with music. You had to go back to Harvard Business School, take care of your business. Can you explain to the youth out there how important education is? Okay, you, you guys. I'm waiting. I've been waiting. 